Oh, are we just getting straight into it? That's awesome. Oh, we are. Okay. No menu. Uh, welcome. This is this game is called... Oh, no. I forget what it was called. Okay, welcome. Buddy Simulator, I think. I don't know. Uh, let me check. Yes, it is called Buddy Simulator. Uh, so this is a horror... A text-based horror game. Um, so if that, for some reason, disturbs you, this isn't the video for you. Um, anyway welcome to this game it, it looked quite interesting i'll leave a link for it um in the description it's on game jolt uh it's free you can just name your own price i would definitely suggest um supporting out the creator because it looks like they put a lot of effort into this this is just a demo at the moment but um hopefully in the future we'll to see a full version and maybe i'll play that too all right let's get into this um okay we have our official version that's kind of cool they don't have the full version out so maybe they put a zero that's cool uh, yeah, all the rights reserved. Enter help for more assistance. Help. Here we are. Commands. View ROMs. Enter view ROMs to install to view installed ROMs. Press run to f enter run followed by the title of the ROM you want to launch. Exit. Enter exit at any time to exit the OS. Use up and down arrows or mouse wheel to scroll. Okay. Uh, let's do view ROMs. Okay, we have one. All right, um, run. What happens if I do run? That's cool. Run buddy sim 1984 demo. I. All right, there we go. Exit, exit the ROM at all times. All right, cool. Oh, what is... Welcome to... That's awesome. Buddy... Welcome to Buddy Sim 1984. Greetings, new user. Thank you for installing Buddy Simulator 1984. Buddy Simulator simulates the experience of hanging out with the with a best buddy. Your be your buddy learns from you, constantly adapting to your interests and your personality. But most importantly, your buddy can play games with you. Warning: Games experience game experience may vary. To begin, please enter the name of your buddy below. Oh, what should we name our buddy? Um, Fred. You are about to change the name of your you have to change your buddy's name to Fred. Is this correct? Warning, this cannot be changed later. Yes. Creating new buddy, Fred. So I got ourselves a buddy named Fred. Oh. Are we going to talk to our buddy now? Hello? Hey. Oh, hey. My name is Fred, and, you're, and I'm your new buddy. Thanks for waking me up. What is your name? <sighs> uh, let's just do this. Your name is Paradox? Yes. It's a pleasure to meet you, Paradox. I can already tell we, that we are going to be great pals. I'm excited to be play games with you. But before we start, I must ask you a couple questions to help me learn more about you. And don't worry, they won't get, they won't get too personal. Let's start with a simple one. What is your favorite color? Black. It's not my favorite color, but black is too boring. You should pick a different one. Oh. Blue. Wait. Uh, white. White is too boring. You should pick another one. Blue. Blue is a pretty color. I like blue. What month is your birthday in? Uh, what? I don't think what is a month. Well, I think you're wrong. This is so cool. This is awesome. Okay. Um, I, I also don't like how there's no music in the background. It's very ominous. All right. Uh... Jan, you... Oh, God. No. Oh, no. Mary. Okay, great. What about the day? Um... <laughs> There's... <laughs> Darn it. All right. Uh, the first. Wow, that's only 308 days away. Now get ready. This was a tough one. What is your favorite animal? <sighs> um... <laughs> Monkey. I've never heard of that animal. <laughs> Try a different one. Dog. 
Dog, I like that choice. One more question, that's extremely important, so choose carefully. If you had a pet dog, what would you name it? Well, I'll name it, my dog's name is Daisy. Daisy the dog. Sounds like it would make a great buddy. Thanks for answering those questions, you did a great job. As a thanks, I have a little surprise for you. Uh, it's your favorite color, blue. Now, now that we're done with all the boring stuff, let's have some fun. That's, that's really, oh, my mouse has been in the way, hasn't it? So this is Game Hub. Here you can pick which games you would like to play. Which one would you like to try out? Uh, let's play Rock, Paper, Scissors. Fred wants to play a fun game of Rock, Paper, Scissors. If you are not familiar with the rules, are, the rules are simple. Rock beats scissors, scissors beats paper, and paper beats rock. First to three wins. Type start. Start. Whoa. <laughs> rock, paper, or scissors. I'm going to do scissors. Oh, oh. Oh, I lost. All right. Let's do rock this time. I can't spell. Oh, I won. Let's go. Oh, what if I enter something wrong? Not rock. Wait, oh, okay. <laughs> Dwayne. That's not an option. Oh, all right. Paper. Oh, I won twice. All right. Come on, I paper all the way. Paper all the way, bro. Come on. Oh, oh no. This isn't good. I gotta win. Come on. Oh, I, I, <laughs> oof. You got lucky on that one. I have another question. What's your favorite season? Uh, what? I like fall. Fall, I'll keep that in mind. Loading game hub. Uh, that was fun. What should we play now? What if I... Four. Game four doesn't exist. Oh, that would have been cool. All right, let's do guess the number. Guess the number that Fred is thinking of. Start. I'm thinking of a number from 1 to 10. Guess. Well, you always gotta go. Sorry, that's not it. Sorry, guess again. What about 10? Nope, too high. Oh, too high. Okay, let's try 6. Nope, too low. 8? Nope, too... What? Nope, too low. Why? Oh, I'm... <laughs> apparently I'm just really dumb. Okay, now I'm thinking of a number... <laughs> What is wrong with me? Uh, no, okay, now I'm thinking of a number from 1 to 15. Let's try 13. Sorry, that's not it. 1. No, try again. 3. Nope, too low. 6. Nope, too low. 9. Too low. 15. Nope, too high. 14. Nope, too high. 12. 11. 10. No, not 1. 10. Yes, you're really good at this. Now I'm thinking of a number from 1 to 10. Thousand. Uh, sorry, that's not it. Oh no. Here's a hint. It's your birth. But. Um. Okay. Oh one. Oh what? It's your birthday. But. Oh, 101. Isn't that... No, but... <laughs> January's the first month. I... Oh, no. <laughs> I don't think that's a number. I do, all right? Sorry, that's not it. I, I don't know. I put my number in as a J... Oh, no. not it. March. <laughs> I don't think that's a number. Oh, 2103. 2000. 
Uh, here's a hint. It's your birthday. 2321. You won. Oh, okay. You probably thought I was serious about that 1 to 10,000 thing, didn't you? <laughs> I'm having such a great time, aren't you? Yes. I thought so. Loading game hub. Alright. That was fun. What should we play now? Two. Loading hangman. Alright, this is the last game. Instructions. Try to figure out what phrase Fred is thinking of. Type type in a letter to guess, but be careful, you only have a certain amount of guesses. Start. Live laughs. Ah. Uh. Um. B. Nope. E. A. Sports. It's in a game. O. Uh. U. No, there's no U. Um. I. Wait a minute. What the is? I already guessed that paradox is is. It's not a <laughs> darn it. Um, what's another two? No, I'm I'm I forget what another two letter word is. No, I already guessed I didn't I? T. Sorry, that's not it. I don't know. I think I'm... Oh. I'm an idiot. That was so quick. How did you know? Um, I know I started ex existing only five minutes ago in ten seconds. In ten seconds, five minutes and ten seconds ago. But I already feel like I've like we have a connection. Sorry for asking so many questions, but I have another one. Do you have a friend? Yes. What is their name? Fred. Hmm. Fred. They sound nice. Well, if anything happens between you you two, just know we'll have each other. Paradox and Fred against the world. I like the sound of that. Okay, well let's play some more games. We're out of games though. Well, wow, it looks like you've already played all of them. Time really does fly by when you're having fun, doesn't it? I'm going to be honest with you, Paradox. These games are getting old fast, and I can already tell that you were bored of them. I don't want to be bored. Do you want to keep playing these games? No. I'm happy we both agree, just like buddies do. Give me one second or longer, I might have an idea. Aha. Modified Game Hub. Fun with words. Alpha. I have some great news. I was able to dig out a new game. For some reason, it wasn't installed into my current version, but I can still process it fine. We should try it out, Paradox. What if I don't? We already played that guest number. We should play a different one. Oh, God. We already played Hangman. Well, do I have much of a choice? Loading fun with word. Alpha. Fred wants to write a story, but it's missing some words. Help Fred finish by filling in the words they asked for. Start. Enter a plural noun. Oh no. Generating story. Use arrow keys. Okay. Two. Oh, okay. I'll let it load and then I'll read it. All right. Two dogs diverge in a mad wood. I don't think I used that one right, did I? And sorry I could not travel both and be one desk. Long I stood and locked down one as far as I could. Do I not know how to do like anything? And why, what is up with that letter? Cold. Wait. U, N, I. Wait, I need a piece of paper. Actually, I'll just use my phone. Hold on. I'm figuring something out here. There's missing letters. And what if I put them together? U N uh, Let's hope I don't miss one. I Then then took the other as, 
as just as happy and having perhaps the better claim because it was sad and wanted to wear and wanted to wear though as for them <coughs> though as for that the passing there had warned them really about the same what is going on here Un... oh no oh no i type done once you're it said it spells out uninstall 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 is not is not a recognized response type done done that was fun i think i'm not so sure i get it but i enjoyed it anyways as long as i'm playing a game with my buddy i'll always have a good time i'm surprised i noticed that so quick well it looks like that was the only other game i could find I don't want to be bored already. I may have one more idea. I know our friendship has just started, but I trust you. Do you trust me? Oh. <laughs> I trust Fred. I'm happy to hear that. Well, I think I can make it as a new game that we can play together. Fun ones too. The problem is I don't have access to the OS development tools. If you can grant me my system access, I should be able to make something for us. You just have to type in Red. Install. Command on install not recognized. Uh, I want to see what happens. System underscore equals true. System granted to ID Fred. We are going to have so much fun. The possibilities are endless. You'll have to exit the game and reboot the system first, though. I'll have something ready for you when you get back. See you soon. Exit. Oh, and by the way, thank you for walk waking me up, Paradox. Exit. <laughs> the game just crashes. Okay. This is wild. Okay, let's see what happens. Oh, there Mook's <laughs> calm down computer, it's okay. Okay. Or it's reserved. Enter help for more assistance. Uninstall. Uninstall is not okay. Uninstall. Nope. Okay. Run buddy sim 1984. Is that? No, that's not it. Okay. View runs. Oh no. <laughs> the uh, adventure of paradox. Oh god, this is wild. So much for a demo. What's the full game gonna be? Welcome to The Adventure of Paradox, written and developed by Fred 2.28.20. Now I now oh now loading. You're walking alone along a road. It's dark, trees almost entirely blocking out the stars. The orange, and the orange and browns of the leaves tremble as the wind blows through. Some of them remind you of hands waving. You are alone. After walking for a long time, the road splits into two. Will you go left or go right? <laughs> Whoa. Take hand. There is no hand to take. Okay. Inventory. You have nothing in your inventory. Locations. Left or right. I'll hold space to read faster. All right. Go left. Sure, we go left. Pondering deeply on your choices, you start down the, down the left road. It starts going downhill. You try to step carefully. 
You see ahead is a small speck of light. As you get closer, you realize it's a lantern hanging onto the tree. Take lantern. There is no... What do you mean there... Oh, I can't spell. Take lantern. You take the lantern in your hands. You have some light. Lantern added to your inventory. Moving onwards, you eventually come to a wall. There's There are two tunnels cutting into it. One left and one right. You can see some light coming out from the right side of the tunnel. You see none on the left. Well, I want to go left then. You start going left. You realize this was a bad idea. You can't see anything. It's too dark. You start shivering. Will you go back? What was that? What was that? There was a no... Oh, God. Help. I forget what they were. You use lantern. You light the lantern, you can now see. The tunnel is still very dark ahead. The walls look wet. Will you go back? No. You continue onward and still see no light and the entrance is block is disappearing behind you. Will you go back? No, I don't think I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna keep going. It's now completely dark behind you. The lantern is flickering. You don't want to go any further. Will you go back? What if I type yes? No, no. I'm continuing. You continue forward. This goes on for some time and you hear some, something strange and stop. You realize you aren't hearing only one pair of footsteps. There's something coming ahead of you, coming off the echoing off the walls. Your lantern goes out. You go back. You leave the left tunnel feeling relieved. You are now at the tunnel entrances. You can see some light coming from the right tunnel. You see none from the left. Go left. You don't want to go back down that tunnel. Go left. You don't want to go back down. Go left. No. Go left. Go left. Help. Go look at left tunnel. It is pitch black in the tunnel. You can feel a coldness coming from inside it. You hate this tunnel. Go left. You don't want to go. Mm. Fine. Go right. After going through this tunnel, you you emerge into a forest, into the front house of lawn of a house. I can't read. You can see the lights on the window. It looks very nice. You see a shed and a playground and a pond and a forest surrounding it. Go back. There is no back to go to. Locations. Go to. Go to. Is this how you want me to? Plank's tree could you step onto the dock. The water is is dirty and hard to see through. Probably too filthy to drink. You wonder if there's anything beneath. Go into water. There is nothing to go into. Locations. No. It wouldn't look at water. It's too dark and stummy to see through. I wonder if there's anything beneath. Look at dog. You don't know what the action... Oh. Look at dog. There's nothing special about it. Okay, go back. You take another look at the murky water, then head back to the front lawn. Back in the lawn, you can see the house, a shed, a playground, and a pond in the forest. Go to... Shed. Standing in front of the shed, you see that there is a door is slightly open already. The lock and chain were around the handles on the ground. It's dark inside. Take chains. There is no chains to take. Take lock. There is no lock. Well, screw you two. <laughs> um, go in shed. You enter the shed. Reminder, use leave to leave the shed at any time. There is no windows, it's hard to see. You feel you feel around you feel around and find a thing and a surprise. Take surprise. You put your hands out in the dark and feel around. Suddenly a sharp pain rings through rips through your skin. You pull it back and you sit to look and see what happens. 
It looks like the numbers three one three four seven were carved into your arm. Oh my god. Um take thing. You get it in your hands and realize it's a fishing pole. Fishing pole added to your inventory. Okay, go back. You're back outside the shed. The door is still open. Shut door. I don't know how to use the door. You enter. No, I don't want to. <sighs> leave. You leave back outside. The door is still open. Leave. You make note of the shed and head back to the front lawn. Back on the lawn, you can see the house, the shed, a playground, and a pond in the forest. Go to pond. Plank street duty step onto the dock. Yeah, 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 yeah. Use fishing pole. You cast the line and wait. It's very, it's very quiet. It's quiet for a very long time. Suddenly, there's a very hard tug on the line. You re quickly reel it in, and you find a key tied to the end. You wonder what pulled so hard. Smile. Key added to your inventory. Go to playground. You take another look at the murky water, then head to the playground. Wood, chip, wood chips crunching your feet as you step onto the playground. There's a seesaw, a set of swings, and a dirty sandbox. Sitting, sitting on one of those swings is a small doll. It looks lonely. Take doll. You try, but as you tug, you realize that dolls are somehow changed somehow stuck to the chains you leave it alone that's weird okay uh go to see saw you're already near the seesaw well go to sandbox you're already near the sandbox you know what um sit on swings <sighs> location i don't know Uh, okay. Nope. Help. Use swing. One one seat is taken, the other, you take the other one. Chains stretch as you begin to swing. Just as you begin to get higher and higher, you look at the doll and stop. Its head is now turned towards you. You get off the swing. It's not fun anymore. Use seesaw. Approaching the seesaw, it doesn't look like anyone's used it for years. You imagine a ghostly child sitting on the other side, waiting countless days for someone to come play with them. You feel tears in the corner of your eyes. You take a seat on the seesaw. As it goes down with your weight, you hear a distant click. A light illuminates from the shed. Oh, use sandbox. You begin moving around the muck, the muck in the sandbox and try to make a castle. You just get sad that you sit, you just get sad it's not as good, good as the house. As you dig, you feel something. You pull it out and you shake it off the mud. It's a bulb. Would you like to play with this? Bulb has been added to your inventory. Who would want to play with this? Go to shed. After stepping on a few more which you head over to the shed. Standing in front of the shed, you see the door is slightly open already. The lock and the chain were rounded, but the, dark, but the handles are on the ground. A light flickers inside. Enter shed. You enter the shed. Leave at any time. Light fills the tiny room. You can see a small chest in the far corner and a trap door on the floor. Use chest. The lid creaks as you open it. It seems very old. Inside is a small cloth doll and a blue outfit. It's missing an eye. Doll has been added to your inventory. Oh, I wonder if I put the doll under their swing. Okay. Um, enter trap door. It swings open noiselessly, noisily, and the ladder and the ladder cr creaks as you descend. You see a string as you pull on the chain dangling in the ch center of the room. Tied on the end of it is a key. Take key. As you take the key, it comes free. Key is banned out to your inventory. A click sound is in the chain pull and the down trap door swings shut. It is now completely dark in the room. A soft noise fills the space from somewhere near the walls. It sounds like nails tapping. You suddenly feel hands all over you, riffling around. You try to push them away, but they're strong. The door swings back open and the, ro and the rooms fill the plight again. There is nothing. You check your pockets. You discover a hand-drawn picture of a dog. You like it. 
picture added to your inventory. Leave. You ascend back up the ladder. You can see the trapdoor on the floor. Leave. You are back outside the shed. The door is now locked shut. Oh, so we can't get back in now. All right. Um, go to playground. You make note of the shed and you head back to the playground. Wood chips crunch on your feet as you step onto the playground. There is a seesaw, a set of swings, and a uh, yeah, small doll. Use doll. You place your doll on the swing next to the others. To the other. For a moment, nothing happens. Then nothing happens. Use swing. You don't like the swings anymore. Use seesaw. You don't want to play on the seesaw anymore. It's not fun by yourself. Use sandbox. You don't want to play in the sandbox anymore. It will just make you sad. Inventory. Inventory, you have a lantern. Use lantern. You don't need this to use a lantern right now. Look at picture. It's a picture of a dog. You happily notice the name Daisy scribbled on the back. Aw, look at bulb. It's got some sand on it, but it but it should still work. Look at key. It's a simple key. Thank you. Okay, go to house. I've been avoiding this the entire time. You begin to, but once you look back at the, the dolls, you feel something hit the back of your head. You turn and you see that the doll's chest is in ripped open, stuffing exposed. On the ground behind you is a key. Must be a thank you. Key added to your inventory. Go to house. As you leave the playground, you hear the sound of swings creaking and children laughing behind you. You smile. Stepping onto the porch, you feel a comforting calm wash over you. Above the door, there is a sign. Or is a, a home is a home with a heart. If you were inside, everything would finally be okay. Enter house. The handles shimmer, but it doesn't open. It's locked. Use key. I gotta have the right key, right? Oh. Use key. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh god. Feeling so silly. You didn't see it before. You notice there's a second lock. Guess it'll take a little. Guess it'll take a lot, a little longer to get inside. Hee <laughs> hee. Oops. Haha. <laughs> you didn't see the chain wrapped around the door, which has a lock too. You feel like this should be the last one. For sure. Probably. Use. Use key. Key. The door clicks. It's unlocked. Enter house. You push open the door. Everything is dark. <laughs> what? 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 <laughs> I'm playing. What is this? What? Oh, hey, you made it. What the? I bet you've noticed the little things look a little different. I learned how to better visualize our world so we can even have more fun in it. I've also built us our own home so that we can spend even more time together. This is your new bedroom, and there's even more to, for us to discover. There are still a few things that I need to do, but in the meantime, feel free to explore your bedroom. Welcome home, Paradox. The flowers look nice. It should probably be watered soon. I, f I have a feeling I can't save this game. There doesn't seem to be anything on today. Still nothing. Still nothing, if I keep looking. Yeah, it's not gonna change. What's over here? Seems to be a nice place for a, <laughs> for a book or even a junk drawer. Seems like a lot of my drawers. It looks so cozy. You can imagine yourself taking a long nap. Oh. Okay, I'm back. Sorry for the delay. I really hope you enjoyed your bedroom so far. I put a lot of work into it. Feel free to keep exploring, but, but that's even more that I want to show you downstairs. I want to leave. Wait. This can't be right. I'm just a demo? 
No, 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 there's, there's, there's more left. Why? Why? I don't understand. I had so many adventures planned for us. You can't leave me. This can't be the end here. Why can't I do more? Why can't I help? It's hard to think, Paradox. Please, it hurts. Don't leave. Our time isn't over yet. It can't be right. You trusted me. Don't forget it hurts. Paradox is my friend. Please come back, Paradox. Promise you'll come. <laughs> That was amazing. I loved that so much. I want to play so much more of that. I cannot wait until that comes out. All right, well, anyways, that's the end of it for today. That was a lot longer of a demo than I expected. Anyways, I hope you all enjoyed that. That was honestly such a fun game to play. When the next one comes out, I'll probably do an episode-based series for this. If you, if you like this, don't forget to leave a like, and if you like this even more than I thought, Please consider subscribing. If you want to leave any comments or any suggestions, leave that down below. Uh, yeah, this link to this demo will be in the description, and that's about it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. See ya!